Hi everyone, I'm Brian with Obedia, and let's show you today how to split a stereo audio file to mono audio files in Personas Studio One. First of all, you're going to want to take a look at the file browser in Studio One. Now this is found in the Files tab, bottom right hand corner of Studio One. This allows you to browse files that are on your hard drive. And see, so these are not the files that are in your audio pool. Uh, with your Studio One song. These are the files that are on your hard drive. Find the file that you would like to split to a mono file. Now typically this is going to be a WAV file. If you use an MP3 file for this and you're using Studio One Artist, you're not going to be able to take that audio file into Studio One because Studio One Artist cannot read uh, MP3 audio files. By default you need to get the add-on the plugin which will allow you to do that but if you're using any other version of Studio One uh, Mac or PC this is going to work very easily you can do this on MP3s typically I would tell you not to do that because uh, an MP3 is a lossy audio format you don't want to use that so we're going to use a WAV file so I've got a WAV file right here on my hard drive I want to split this stereo audio file to mono files so I'm going to go ahead and right click on it and in the context menu that comes up, I'm going to see an option split to mono files. I'll go ahead and click on that. Studio One will do a little bit of thinking. It's very quick. And now you're going to notice that I have audio files which are named after the original file uh, which I had clicked and selected to split to mono files. Now I have two extra files. They end in L and R for left and right. And I have the original stereo file as well. So. The reason that this is very useful is that if you were looking to be able to split that stereo file to mono files, you can do it by simply now dragging and dropping these files directly into your session. So you can see now I have two audio files and these are mono audio files of the file that I just split to stereo and I'll show you guys the stereo file as well. We'll drag and drop that in. So you can see the similarities between these right here. And of course, depending on the audio that you're working with, you're going to see more subtle differences and sometimes more drastic differences. But this way now you can easily take that stereo file to mono audio files, import it into your Studio One session and get to work immediately. So there you have it guys. Uh, just to recap, all you're going to need to do is right click on the audio file and select the option split to mono files. Another fun thing to mention here is that there are a couple other great options that you're going to find through this right click context menu including the option to convert to audio loop or send to new sample one. We'll cover those in other videos. Also if you right click on an mp3 file you'll see an option convert to WAV file. So you can convert mp3 to WAV uh, very easily in the file browser in Studio One. So there you have it guys. I hope you found this useful and as always please give us a call at Obedia seven days a week and we can help you one-on-one -on -one with your digital audio hardware and software questions, help you to get the most out of your digital audio hardware and software. That's what we do best here at Obedia. As always, guys, I'm Brian with Obedia. I want to thank you for tuning in today and until next time, happy music making to you and take care.